A CFL team did reach out to me and ask if I wanted to play over in Canada. Mm -hmm. And? Every day brings new life when I'm by your side. All stuff that we're donating. Hi! Hi guys! I've already taken a trip to Savers and we're gonna have to take another one and probably another one after that. And after that, there's just so much stuff that we are getting rid of. Because honestly, I feel like it's just so much easier to just get rid of everything and then rebuy it. But most of the stuff we won't even have to rebuy. It's like the kids just grow out of things. So it's crazy to see how much stuff we've just been like hoarding here that it takes us moving out of state to finally just get rid of it. Yeah, that's our. Well, no, this car's not ours. Let me get that. Got our U box here. Okay, what's the challenge? This. You ready? You gotta throw the ball in there, spin 360, catch it before it hits the ground. Okay, try it. Okay. <laughs> oh, dang it. Try again. Take two. <laughs> See? Sick. <laughs> Go, yeah, you're scared. Okay. <laughs> Hell, you didn't even turn around. Well, then I have to... Don't throw it. Oh my. Why do you throw it so high? There's a ceiling there. It's okay. It has to go high. Okay. <laughs> I don't like this. Okay. Oh, I don't yeah, you're <laughs> terrible. Seriously? Is she terrible? <laughs> hey, hold on, hold on, hold on. Nope. <laughs> She's laughing at you. You suck. Look at you. You suck. The house is still looking pretty crazy, but I guess it's kind of coming along. You wouldn't think so because it still looks like this, though. A little bit chaotic, but let me show you. We're about to do another trip to Sabres. So this is our fourth trip to Sabres now. And here's what our fourth car load to Sabres looks like. Plenty of stuff back there. A lot of stuff that we're just giving away. And then we're just gonna have to rebuy a lot of it. Fun. Yeah. You're just working? Yeah, working. Okay, keep working. I don't what? I, don't I have a question. What? Are we moving? Then how come there's still freaking crap everywhere? How are we supposed to move out with all this crap? Just because we have to take them with us. And then it will be clean. Then it will be clean. We're on like day, what, five? Yeah. Day five of being here? Uh, what did you call me? No, I called them that. Oh, what did you call the J family? Uh, chicken, poop, horse, poopy butt. Ew! You called them chicken, poop, horse, poopy butt? That is absurd. Yeah, Disgusting! You better apologize to the J family. Always a apologize. It's a prank. Oh, it was a prank. She pranked you, J fam. All right. Hey, J family. Today is Naya. Is it? And today we're going to play a hide and seek. A deal, right? Hide seeks. Mhm. Mm so my mom and dad are downstairs, right? Right. And JJ has a messy face from the. <laughs> wow. Yeah, but and what? it's going to be fun. Hmm. I hope I win, and it's going to be a challenging jet. jet. You ready? So I'm going to set you guys right here, and I we're going to do it now. Okay. Bye. Say bye. Bye. Okay, guys. As you start, you, I count and you hide, Jaja. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Ready or not, here we come. Found you. Found me. Okay, it's your turn to find me. Um, 
this is not our hide what I am a plant. I guess I know that I'm hiding in a plant. Come and find me! Find me. You found me already. And we're back. It's so another day of us it's packing. It's been for like a week now. It's not hasn't been a week. Uh, actually, yes. It's been, been a week. A week tomorrow. What's today, Tuesday? I don't know. A week today, actually. Today is Tuesday. We're almost done. I think well, what's- we got here Tuesday night, sir. Right. It is pack, pack miss day six. Pack miss, new thing. Pack miss day six. Excuse our kids, they're watching Allie in the back, so you know kids go crazy for Allie. We're taking our time, honestly, because we feel like we're gonna get down and have to wait for our car anyway. Right, so I think that's kind of why it's been taking so long. But we're almost done. I'll show you guys right now. I know you probably think like, oh my gosh, you're not almost done. We are. Like, Naya, turn it down a little bit for me. Like, all this stuff right here will be going in our car with us, like in our Acadia, our other car, and shipped to Utah. But we're almost done. Look at the hair though, guys. Just admire it again. We're almost done. Hopefully, our car gets done pretty soon so we can freaking get up out of here. She wants to fit this long. It fits. It literally fits. Yeah, it's not safe. It's gonna just pierce through the windshield. It's not safe. No one's gonna be in the freaking car. It's being shipped. Who's unsafe here? But once we, we gotta add more in here. You're just gonna add on top of it? Right, exactly. I'm really mad at freaking you. No. Chomp. It's not nice to call people their words. We were packing a couple days ago and <laughs> Trey was just bullying me. He's just like, you chomp, you stupid chomp. Yeah, chomp, you stupid chomp. And hopefully he's joking. <laughs> no, I guess we just talk to each other like that all the time. And so he's just joking. <laughs> Keeps calling me a chomp, but like being really like belittling. <laughs> And I'm like feeding off of it too, but then he has to be like you chump you stupid chump chump Oh, oh, hey Dan. Hey. Hey Dan. What's up, man? We're just packing. What's up, Dan? So basically our neighbors are probably worried about us Thinks that Trey is belittling me and calling me a chump, but we're fine We're fine well, Got our neighbors worried about us. I was just joking. I would never call you a chump like seriously, unless you're gonna freaking chump, don't call me. Don't be a chump. Hmm? Chump. Say that to my face. Yeah, you're a chump. <laughs> Say it to my freaking face. No. Bye, loser. Yep, chump. <laughs> okay, guys, we are still packing. This is like day 1700 yeah. of packing, and I feel like we still haven't made any progress. I feel like it's still stuff everywhere, but we're still packing. We haven't really been packing. We've been like sitting around doing nothing. So the reason that we are act like going really slow, we've been waiting for our car to get out the shop. If we would have had a Tesla, we would have probably been back in Utah by now. Um, because Miley actually packed up uh, when I got cut from the Cowboys. She packed up our whole house in Texas in like three days or something by herself. Something crazy like that. So we've just been really slow because we're waiting for the car. Because it's kind of hard to know where things are going to go. Excuse me. You're boring me without having our car. So that's why I've been so slow. Okay, so this is what our living situation has been like the past week or so. Yikes. Air mattress. Yikes. Air mattress, no sheets. Yikes. Yeah, we accidentally, we accidentally packed up all of our sheets packed into the U-Box that was already shipped to Utah. So we don't even have any sheets. So we're just sleeping on this air mattress and the room's kind of a disaster right now, but we're about to fix that. Let's go. My hair. Do you need help, Jet? No, I got it. My hair got stuck. There's water. Okay, in kid. Look, Mom. Look, Mom. Wow, buddy. Look. That's amazing. This is the camera. You want to show the camera? Okay, come show the camera. Look, I'm a watermelon. I'm not talking watermelon. Hi. And I'm can I hold it? Um, I got it. Can I hold it? I had it. it. No, I had it. Hi. Hey, let me take the camera. Come here. Um, I'll go. I'll go, Dad. Thank you. 
Okay, so Jet's been struggling with jumping for months. We've been working on this, but do it, Jet, Jet. Show him what you just did. Yes! I'm so happy! Yeah! Jet, that was so good. Do another jump, buddy. Oh my gosh. Yes, kid, do another one. Oh my goodness, you're getting some air time. Two jumps, yeah, do two jumps. Oh my goodness, I'm proud of you, bubs. Do it again. Yeah, and one jump. Yes! All that gymnastics paid off. He's been working on jumping for a long time, guys. He's been working at jumps. He tries all the time. I can't believe he just did it. Oh, best friends, huggy. So we have put packing to rest again to update you guys on what's going on with football. Mm -hmm. So a few weeks ago, a CFL team reached out to me. They texted me, which is really weird that teams can like just text okay. your personal phone because you got an agent. They usually go through your, with the NFL, you usually go with your, through your agent, then your agent reaches out to you. Right. But this team texts CFL, me they directly. Just text they just shoot you a quick text. Hey bro, what's up? You're good, you wanna play? Auto Red Blacks text me and it's like, the text read, good morning Trayvon, this is with the Auto Red Blacks um, and the CFL just reaching out to see if you're interested in still playing pro ball. So a CFL team did reach out to me and ask if I wanted to play over in Canada. Mm -hmm. And he's not I'm gonna not do going. it. <laughs> and the reason I'm not gonna go play over in Canada it's because you are locked in there for two years, so that limits NFL opportunities for two seasons. And I feel like I'm still getting, me and my agent both, feel like I'm still getting enough NFL interest or whatever. So this is the second time that a CFL team has reached out. So we got a new person here, because he couldn't be quiet, so we had to just bring him in. We kept trying to refilm this clip over and over. He's, st he's still talking. Look, yeah, look, just he, listen. Dad's still, talking for a second. Talking. Okay, just give me huggy, and Dad will talk. Okay, go. You good? You good now? Yeah. Okay. Are you gonna, are you gonna throw? All right. So this is the sec. Oh, every <laughs> time I try to say the second. <laughs> you know, you didn't throw up. So. Yes, Mom. <laughs> every time, Jay. So. This is the second time that a CFL team has reached out to me over text. Mm -hmm. They text me both times. Um, first time it was to, <laughs> oh my gosh. <laughs> Just listen to daddy. The second time, the first time was the Hamilton Tiger Cats, this time with the Red Blacks. We're not gonna go play in the CFL because you're locked in for two years, like I said. And- It'd be fun though. It'll be a cool experience eventually. I mean, if I'm still got the football daddy, itch. Mac and cheese Mac hands. Mac and cheese hands. <laughs> Perfect. If I still... <laughs> if I still got the football itch, maybe Canada would be coming to play. But as of right now, I'm just going to head back to Utah and train. And hopefully there's another NFL team. Yes. We have had three teams reach out to my agent, but that was yes. weeks ago. So okay. just keep working out. I am still working out. I work out every day. I, I work out every day. Okay, guys. <laughs> What? Okay, kiss my cheek. Okay, thank you. And your cheek. And my cheek. That cheek. Two cheeks. Okay, kiss it. <laughs> thank you, buddy. Can Dad talk now? Okay. Okay, listen to Dad. Say, talk, Dad. Talk, Dad. Talk, Dad. Okay. Talk, Dad. <laughs> okay. What was I saying? I don't know. Um, I think we're basically done. I've been working out. I work out every day. So we're, right now we just kind of hug you, buddy. <laughs> okay. So right now we just kind of wait. Hug you. <laughs> just keep We just kind of wait for a call and hope that team calls soon. Yep. You want Dad to keep playing football, Jet? Yeah. In the NFL or the CFL? CFL. CFL sounds like. You want to go to Canada? Mm. And then they tax you like crazy over there. So. Hmm. Doesn't like fun. Okay, Naya, come say bye to the camera, to the vlog. Yeah. Bye vlog. Bye vlog. So this vlog is over. We are still not fully packed. 
but it is over. We are almost done. Hopefully next time you see us, we'll be heading to Utah or maybe a fun surprise is coming up. I don't, I don't know. I don't, I don't know. Just, we'll just see what happens. But we cannot end this vlog, hold on. But we cannot end this vlog without, of course, giving our post location shout out. And that goes to? Vixie Stewart. Vixie Stewart, and I actually know Vixie Stewart personally. We used to dance together in junior high. That's so, it. Yeah, thank you for subscribing. That's it. If you would like to be our next post location shout out, you gotta do three things. Three things, right, Naya? Number one, you have to subscribe. Number two, you have to hit the bell to turn on the post notification. And then number three, you have to comment down below on this video. Hashtag PNS. PNS. Make sure you go follow our Instagram. They're gonna be right here. Follow them, follow them, follow them. Stay tuned for me and I's next science project coming up. So exciting, right? Yeah. So make sure you go do that and be Say out. Bye. Every day brings new life when I'm by your side.